Why do you burn your marshmallows? Don't judge. Can you hand me a green? Hey, so what are we doing tonight anyway? Are we gonna do something fun or are we gonna watch her burn marshmallows all night? I thought we could share some scary stories tonight. I like the sound of that. I think I got a good story. Ah, I lost it. You got anything? I have a story. I like to call this one. The Curse of the Bronze Eagle. That sounds kind of stupid. It's not stupid. Just let me tell my story, all right? There was a guy minding his own business when he saw something in the tree. He went over to examine it, and when he picked it up, it was an eagle, a bronze eagle. It screeched at him. He was so scared he put it back in the tree and he ran. He ran for miles. Miles? Maybe like three blocks or something, but he couldn't get it out of his head, that screech. He thought he finally lost it. It just kept coming back. <whistles> Food didn't even taste the same by that point. He couldn't sleep. He couldn't eat. He couldn't even repeat. No matter where he went, it followed him. He decided he should try to rest. He probably slept like maybe three minutes before he turned around. He did the only thing any reasonable person would do. He grabbed it and took it outside. He was ready to end the curse. The only thing standing between it and him was a sledgehammer. And when he raised it in the air... And? Okay. I forgot it, but I'm pretty sure it was going to be a really good story if you just let me just... I think I got one. I lost it again. Well, I have a story. And this one actually has an ending. There was once a girl alone in her house. She heard a noise. And another one. It's a lot of noises. Shh. So she had to go investigate. She looked at the window, seen if anyone's on the other side. She turned on the light, unlocked the door, grabbed the stick, and she went out the door. And as she walked outside slowly, she saw... Oh, oh, okay, I remember the ending now. What? I remember the Bronze Eagle story ending. Come on, bud. I, dude, come on, let me tell the story, please. Fine. All right. So do you remember how he took it from the bed and then he put it outside? Well, he took his sledgehammer, and when he swung, he froze. And then, he died. That's it? That's why you interrupted my story for? What? You didn't like it? No, I didn't like it. Who eating marshmallows is a better story than what you just told. What's wrong with my story? It's not even that good. How can you say that's an ending? That's my ending. It's my ending to share with the rest of you. Well, you're just gonna look at a bronze eagle and be like, oh, I'm dead. Yes. It's a curse. Do you not get how curses work? No, oh, that ending was whack. It was not whack. There are many things that are whack, but that story was not. What, you got a better ending? Is your story better than mine? I'll show you. Follow me. Go. All 
Alright, what are we doing here? Go ahead and open it. Wait, I need a s'more for this. Go ahead. Open it. <sighs> okay. Ooh. That's a bottle for anyway. For safety reasons. Safety reasons? Ooh. I don't see why you need safety reasons. <laughs> Dane. The hell, man? Why do you have a zombie in your shed? It's my pet zombie. How'd you get a pet zombie? Back. Found it in my shed. Okay, how did it get in the shed? If I would have finished my story, you would have heard the ending. Oh, God. No, 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 no. Why do you have a coat? Hey, on the way here. What happened to him? My pet's on me. I liked his story better. Crap. <laughs> he goes down.